If you've ever been driving your diesel vehicle and suddenly saw exhaust system regeneration in progress pop up on your dashboard, you might have panicked. Don't worry. In the next few minutes, I'll explain exactly what this warning means, why it happens, and most importantly, what you need to do when you see it. First, let's understand what's actually happening. Modern diesel vehicles, including Ram trucks, Jeep Gladiators, and other diesel-powered cars and SUVs built after 2007, come equipped with something called a Diesel Particulate Filter, or DPF. Think of the DPF as a sponge in your exhaust system. As you drive, it traps soot and particulates to keep your emissions clean. But just like any filter, it eventually gets full and needs cleaning. That's where regeneration comes in. Your diesel vehicle literally burns off the trapped soot at extremely high temperatures, turning it into harmless ash. This is completely normal and happens automatically. So why does this warning appear in the first place? There are a few common causes. Short trips are the number one culprit. If you're only driving 5 to 10 miles at a time, your diesel engine never gets hot enough to passively burn off the soot. Excessive idling is another problem. Letting your diesel vehicle idle for more than 30 minutes creates soot without generating the heat needed to clean it. Stop-and-go city driving prevents the continuous heat needed for passive regeneration. And light loads mean your engine isn't working hard enough to generate cleaning temperatures naturally. There are actually two types of regeneration happening in your diesel. Passive regeneration occurs silently during normal driving. When you're towing heavy loads or driving on the highway, your exhaust naturally gets hot enough to burn off the soot. You'll never even know it's happening. Active regeneration is what triggers that dashboard warning. This happens when your diesel vehicle hasn't generated enough heat on its own. So it injects extra fuel into the exhaust system to crank up the temperature and force a cleaning cycle. You typically only see the warning when the filter reaches 80 to 90% full, meaning previous regeneration cycles didn't complete. Here's the critical part. When you see this warning, do not turn off your diesel. This is extremely important. Keep driving. Ideally at highway speeds, around 50 to 65 miles per hour. The process needs about 15 to 30 minutes to complete. The message will disappear on its own once the regeneration is finished. During this time, your vehicle is operating normally. There's nothing wrong with it. If you absolutely must stop and park, be very careful where you leave your diesel vehicle. The exhaust system is running at extremely high temperatures during regeneration. Never shut off your engine in the middle of regeneration. If you do, you'll leave diesel fuel sitting in your emissions system. This can cause expensive damage and potentially cost you over $1,000 in repairs. Don't panic and don't rush to the dealership. Just let your diesel do its job. Want to avoid seeing this warning so often? Here's what you can do. Take your diesel on longer highway drives regularly. At least 20 to 30 miles of continuous driving helps keep the system clean. Avoid excessive idling. A few minutes to warm up in cold weather is fine, but don't let it sit running for extended periods. If you have a diesel truck, put it to work occasionally. Towing, hauling, or driving with a load helps generate the heat needed for passive regeneration. And if you live in a cold climate, those short trips are even more problematic. The diesel engine takes longer to reach operating temperature.